Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels, or if you're watching my uh, lifestyle channel, hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle. I love talking about travel and lifestyle, and um, again, um, hi, if you're new here to my channel, my name's Rebecca, and I love talking about travel and uh, lifestyle. Please subscribe, it's uh, the red and white subscription button, also click the notification bell so you never miss the upload, and it's free to subscribe, and I upload five times a week to both my travel and my lifestyle channel. So today's video is going to be Travel News UK 5 Exciting Facts November 2021. So I'm going to fire away with The Guardian. Uh, we felt like Vikings. Um, you can go into a UK winter cabin and glamping stay. Um, mentioned in, in the Guardian uh, newspaper um, which is um, number one a cosy cabin in Whitstable in Kent um, huts from £85 per night um, JG and um, it also includes a sea view um, cabin so they look absolutely wonderful and uh, number two, if you want to go glamping on a dairy farm, West Devon, wooden glamping pods on Alistair's uh, Beef and Sheep Farm um, in the tranquil Devon countryside uh, from £60 a night uh, for up to four people. So that's really good um, price in my opinion um, for four people um, a night so you can just uh, split it and um, the costs um number two at uh, sky news uh covid19 uh, final seven countries including colombia peru are removed from the uk's uh, red travel list the final several con uh, seven countries have been removed um basically ending the need for people to quarantine in a hotel yay that's really good news and obviously it also um, helps people returning from those uh, countries as well so they don't need to now quarantine in a hotel now number three i news is a nhs covid pass foreign office warns proof of a vaccination downloaded before the 1st of November 2021 not valid for um, travel at uh, PDF uh, version of the NHS uh, COVID pass downloaded before Monday the 1st of November um, is not valid uh, entry for the EU unfortunately or 17 other nations enrolled in EU digital um, number four you uh, travelweekly.com say Spain uh, calls on the UK trade to help reboot uh, build tourism but then a, a lot of countries again around the world are going to be uh, crying out for um their nations um so, uh, so their countries uh, can be put uh, rebuild tourism as quickly as possible uh, last but not least the independent says when can british travelers return to australia the only way uh, for an um, ordinary british uh, tourist to spend any time in australia is um it basically uh, get a connecting flight that uh, connects to Australia unfortunately we can't uh, the car just go straight there from the UK and um, because again it's too long so uh, again you have to make a connection to go to Australia so um those are all the fantastic facts and um, 
so I would like to say thank you for watching um, and I'll see you again for another travel video which uh, will be on Sunday and I would like to say bye, uh, bye for now and um, on Sunday I'm going to be doing uh, improvements, updates and more video um, and um, again I love uh, talking to you all um, about travel and lifestyle and bye for now thank you bye